All right, good day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm extremely excited to bring you a massive, massive opportunity right now. Uh, there's lots of stuff going on with this project. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about Card Starter, explain what this is and why you should care, some key things that you need to be aware of going on with this project, uh, uh, the IDOs they're launching, uh, the launch pads, massive opportunity in the space. I'm gonna talk about projects that I think have massive massive gains in their future this this episode is gonna be jam-packed with tons of extremely helpful knowledge that you guys need to be aware of there's lots of potential gains as well as risk with the projects uh, in the opportunities here that i'm about to discuss so folks if you like the sound of that i need you to do me a favor i need you to like subscribe comment and share and hit that bell icon notified of new uploads because i've been talking about card starter here a brand new launch pad for the cardano ecosystem ever since this thing was 12 to, to $20 in our VIP Discord group. If you wanna join our VIP Discord group and talk about the, and see the low cap gems that we're looking at before anyone else does, link for that is it down in the description below through our Patreon. You could take a look at what I was talking about. Look at the timestamps. I was talking about this thing all throughout these ranges here, folks. And I don't think this is anything. I still think this is massive, massive early days with this thing. And I'm about to explain why. So. This thing has had a massive run-up, but let's first explain what this thing is and why you should care. So Card Starter is a launch pad for the Cardano network, kind of similar to how Polka Starter is a launch pad for, you know, yes, the Polkadot coins and a lot of other projects as well. So the way this works is that you have to hold 500 cards for seven days and you can get the opportunity to gain allocation uh, to one of the IDOs that they launch on their platform, potential allocation. If you hold 1,500 cards for seven days, you get guaranteed allocation to the, to the brand new projects launching on their IDO. And right now specifically is an extremely critical time because they've just announced the first project that they plan on launching, Charlie 3, one of the first oracles on the Cardano ecosystem. This is a big deal, folks. The fact that one of the first projects they're launching is an Oracle, this is giant. This could be like trying to, like getting in on Chainlink uh, back when it was, I mean, it just in the, in the pre-sale phases. Very, very bullish on this project long-term. As well, they've apparently also partnered with none other than BitBoy Crypto. This is a giant, giant deal, folks. This project is very new. There's very few people holding this. I This still has not been confirmed. I haven't seen BitBoy Crypto talk about this on his Twitter or any announcement channels or on, on his YouTube. So th this still has to be con you know confirmed. I wanna hear it from, from his camp. Uh, but if this, uh, if this partnership is in fact true, this could skyrocket cards because if we look at cards here on either skin, and we look at their token distribution and we see the amount of people who are actually holding this project. There's only 2,600 addresses holding card starter here. Nobody is holding this project. It is super early on this thing. There's only about, you know, just over 2,000 individuals, humans holding this project. Nobody has found out about this thing yet. It's so, so early. So if Bitboy Crypto does indeed, it comes out that, you know, we hear it from them. Uh, they partnered, they're shilling in, they're, you know, talking about their partnership. Folks, this thing could absolutely skyrocket. If Bitboy Crypto starts making videos talking about this thing, it's gonna bring tens of thousands of eyes to this project. And I wouldn't be surprised if this, if the amount of holders holding this project doubled or tripled if Bitboy Crypto starts to shill this thing. Again, still has yet to be confirmed. I wanna hear this from their camp. But if this is indeed the case, they're, bar they're partnering with Bitboy, Folks, this could absolutely skyrocket. So yes, it has it has skyrocketed, and there's tremendous risk with this thing. You'd be buying basically the top, extremely risky. This could have a massive, you know, this this could pull back. Um, the team seems to be anonymous. I, I still haven't confirmed that because I, I've been looking. I can't I can't seem to find who the team is. Another thing too, Bitboy Crypto has said that he doesn't partner or get into projects that with anonymous teams. So I I don't know what's going on with that. I don't. Maybe I'm just shitty at re doing research. I've been looking. I can't seem to find the team. I'm gonna keep looking. If I find who the team is, I'll let our Discord uh, people know. Link for, to join our Discord is down in the description below. I also don't know what the token uh, unlock or release schedule is with this thing because we can see here that actually 91% of the supply is in these two addresses here, these two contracts. So I don't know how that supply is gonna be released into the circulating supply. So what happens is oftentimes 
uh, projects will release their token. Um, and sometimes, you know, four months after the token generation event, uh, they'll start to release uh, the more of their supply. So I don't know what the timeline for that is. I don't know how or when they're going to be releasing more of this supply. So there's a few risks here. We, I'm, I still haven't figured out what, how, if the team is anonymous or not, who the team is. I don't know the token uh, release schedule. I don't know if there's going to be a bunch of new supply coming in, uh, you know, soon right around or later. Uh, you know, a rug pull could always happen. And, you know, this thing has had a mass, massive run up. So those are a lot of the risks. Now, with that being said, take a look at how many people are holding this. It's so few people. Take a look at the projects that they're starting to launch. And again, you know, it, you know, Polka Starter is like the launch pad for the dot ecosystem. Could this be like the launch pad for the Cardano, Cardano ecosystem? Sure, I think so. I think it could be. And with these card and with uh, smart contracts coming soon, just a few months away, I definitely want to get on the ground floor in a lot of these Cardano projects because I think there's plenty of upside. So, given the risk. Uh, given the potential reward here, getting into you know projects such as this, and seeing the fact that Bitcoin Crypto could be shilling this thing in the near future, uh, let's but let's say he doesn't. Let's say he, for whatever reason it, that falls through, there's still just so few people actually holding this. It's such early stages. I think over the long term, the token itself will probably increase in, in value, even if in the short term we have a substantial correction, and you can potentially gain allocation to a lot of these new projects coming up. So in terms of how I, the, the approach I would take, again, none of this is financial advice, I'm not a financial advisor, this, this could correct a lot tomorrow, no guarantee that this will continue to go up. But the approach I would take is personally, I would, uh, the, the approach I am taking is I'm just buying every dip. Every time we we, uh, uh, we get near one of these Fibonacci retracement levels, I'm personally buying. So here at the 236, around uh, $30, $29, I'm buying that dip. Here around the 382, $23, $24, I'm buying that dip. Here at the 0.5, 19, 20 dollars, I'm buying that dip. But ultimately, if we ever fell back in, back within the golden pocket here, from about you know 14 dollars to about 20 bucks, would be the perfect buy the dip opportunity, in my opinion, for myself. Uh, that's typically where things like to retrace to after a massive run up. So if this thing does correct, I'll just be buying more because uh, you know. Again, I, I would like, although it's a shit ton of money, to get uh, guaranteed allocation um, to these products. So uh, let's actually do the math here. So five, you need 500 uh, cards for a minimum of seven days in order to potentially get allocation. So if we multiply five by the current price of about, uh, let's say 32.3, let's just do 33 for easy math here. Uh, <laughs> wow, that's 16,500 US dollars. So it's quite a lot, not, not accessible for the vast majority of people, but again, you know, just, just something to think about. Maybe if we retrace a bunch, maybe if we fall back to these regions, maybe it becomes more realistic for a lot of people. And let's say you were to do a 1500, which is guaranteed allocation. Holy shit. That's like 50,000 US dollars right now at the current prices. So lots of money, lots of risk, but also lots of potential reward with this thing. Also, we've been taking a look at a, at our, um, at our portfolios recently and, uh, and kind of reviewing things. And we're actually moving around a lot of stuff in order to move more into launch pads. Because folks, these launch pads have been launching projects that do 20, 50, 100, 300 X's. So uh, we've started to move into paid network. Uh, Polka Starter we've been in for a while. Launch Pool we've been in for a while. And now Card Starter. So those are the four launch pads that we're into. Not financial advice, not a financial advisor. Uh, I would love to be into, into all these launch pads if I could. But I have to be selective because I don't have... I'm not completely <laughs> made of money, so I have to be you know, very selective about what I choose to get in. So that's personally what we're in, but these are all the, or at least the most popular launch pads currently here at, on CoinGecko. Uh, very interesting stuff. Now, um, so there's been something, a very interesting development, which is Paid Network is partnering with Superfarm to launch a kind of partnered IDO, where you, you could, if you hold 1,000 Super, that'll give you like one ticket, one potential allocation to their partnered IDO projects. Or if you heard, if you hold 1,000 paid or 500 Super and 500 paid. Anyways, I'll leave a link to the instructions and how it works down in our Discord group. So join our Discord. Link for everything is down in the description below. Join our VIP Discord through our Patreon if you want to gain access to the low-cap gems that we're looking at before we talk about it here on the channel. Uh, so join that. Link for that is down in the description below. And uh, I, we're going to be looking to get into this thing as, as, uh, as well. I've been getting into paid uh, recently. I wish I got into it sooner. Uh, but they're going to be having some kind of partnership with Super Farm. So even more opportunity because I, I wanted to buy paid and I, I had a bunch of Super anyway. So so the fact that they're doing something where you can just hold paid and super and you get even more allocation or potential allocation, even better. So folks, plenty of opportunity in the Launchpad ecosystem. Uh, you know, 
paid network and super farm getting together uh these are the top projects that that we're getting into paid polka starter l pool and card starter uh very early stages for card starter here lots of potential uh risk lots of potential reward very low circulating supply although there are a bunch of unknowns as well and the fact that we're, they're partnering with bitboy crypto and the uh the, the amount of people holding this is so low that if indeed this partnership does manifest and it's real uh this thing could really really fly but regardless of that i'm, I'm just interested in the projects that they're launching so folks if you like this video and you want more who doesn't want absolute gold i mean even here it's probably still early like subscribe comment share and hit that bell icon to be notified of new uploads and again personally i would want to wait for a pullback this has had such a massive run up okay we're getting long looks to the upside we could probably have more of a substantial correction so maybe you know i'm not financial advice not financial advice but maybe wait for that pullback again if people start shilling this thing it's probably not going to pull back just being real with you guys all right that's it for me thank you so much for watching until next time take care